All right, welcome back. Joining us now virtually, we have Mike Frugge from JT Mellick Distilleries. Good afternoon, Mike. How are you doing today? Oh, we're doing great. Happy to be here. Uh, we are so happy to have you. So we're, we're going to be demoing a Mardi Gras cocktail that you guys created. But before we get to that, let's talk about uh, the alcohol that you guys brew. It's all from, from rice. Yeah, the, the, um, the brand that we have is, you know, JT Millick. It's a vodka that we create right here on our farm. Uh, we grow the rice, we distill it, we bottle it. Everything's done right here on the farm. What made you want to get into distilling vodka? Well, we didn't set out to be a distiller. We set out to add value to our rice. Um, we looked at a lot of things and a lot of dead ends and looked at it you know, over many years, actually. Uh, one day we were all brainstorming and somebody said, wonder if you can make vodka out of this. And <laughs> it turns out, sure enough, you can. That's, that's kind of cool. So how would you describe the taste um, compared to traditional vodka? So rice, or at least our rice, our brand, the, the JT Millick brand, we, uh, we find it's a very smooth and almost viscous, very thick on the, the tongue, uh, just uh, people call it dangerously smooth. Uh, it's uh, just incredibly drinkable, even over ice. It mixes well with everything. Uh, most people comment that you, quote unquote, can't taste the vodka. So <laughs> <laughs> it almost makes it too good. But uh, I'm a martini drinker, and uh, when we were doing our testing, that was the drink I put it in because you pretty much can't hide anything yeah. there. And, uh, you know, obviously it's my brand, but I didn't start making this particular recipe because I wanted to sell vodka. I made it because it was a, a, one of the best vodkas I'd ever tasted. And uh, I'll say that from the heart. It's that good, you know. I'm my, my first taste it. was the best martini I'd ever had. So. <laughs> I, I love that. So now you say it, it kind of goes with everything. So go ahead, give us a sneak preview of the drink that we're about to, to make coming up. So we're going to make a Millic Masquerade. Uh, it's a drink we developed uh, for the holidays for, for Mardi Gras. You know, Mardi Gras is sort of canceled, but we're trying to keep up the tradition. Um, it's got, of course, it's got JT Millick and four other ingredients. I'll go over all that when uh, we get to it. Um, I'm excited. We think it's, we take it's delicious. So. I cannot wait to try it. We're all going to try to make it ourselves. You're going to try to guide us through it. It's going to be a fun time for sure. Mike, thank you so much for joining. We're going to check back in with you later on during the show. But before we go to break, let's set it on over to Adam Olivier.